All right, I'm going to have a go at the Guardian's weekly cryptic crossword. Uh, this week it's set by Carpathian. Small, pale lad, beginning to generate, final piece of work. Well, small is S, and for pale, uh, wan comes to mind, which would give us swan. And then a final piece of work is a swan song. Lad is sun, and the beginning to generate is that G. All right, gives us some starters. Clue idiots rewritten, causing anxiety. So it seems to be an anagram of clue idiots. Um, and it means causing, oh if, yeah, so is it causing anxiety or is it just anxiety? Um, not sure, let me pause, sip my coffee and think about what that anagram could be. No, I'm not seeing that anagram. I'm sure it's very obvious, but uh, let's try and get some other letters for it. Overturned pot plant containing artist. Note left exactly. Ooh, um, overturned could be another anagram. Pot plant has eight letters. And... Artist is usually R-A. And it's, it's the definition note left exactly. Oh, my goodness. Um, two tough anagrams to start with. Um, I'm thinking A-P-P -P exactly. Note left. Oh, that. No, I'm not getting that one. Uh, so I'm going to have to get some of the acrosses. Lines in, for example, witty remark. Um, for example, can be say. Oh, yes, and if you put L for line and then another L, because it's lines, you get a sally, a witty riposte. All right, here's a long one. Fan fanatics with arrows getting essentials. I don't think this is an anagram, but I think it's going to be a charade of... Fanatics, something, and, oh, yes, fanatics are nuts, with is and, arrows is bolts. How is that the same thing? I think arrows maybe you can use as a verb to move quickly, and you can bolt, of course. And then the nuts are, and bolts are the uh, the bare essentials of something. All right, former partner leaving exotically a new unusual place. Well, former is usually X, and then I wonder if partner leaving exotically or exotically unusual as you take maybe w for wife out of some other word um and so maybe it just means place which could be a verb to place something no not getting that um how about taste of masala say left out uh, for form. So I'm sure many people have uh, made a pun on curry flavor and curry favor. So a taste of masala would be a curry flavor, but be left the L, oops, 
I say L and of course I type it. Uh, so the L is removed uh, to fawn over someone as, as well as to curry favor. Now we do have a C there that may help. Um, but not not just yet. All right, uh, where can we go? And that one, oh, so maybe, maybe the RA is there for the artist. All right, how about um, coach in utter defeat, returning, embracing team's leader. Team's leader is T. It's a coach. Uh, first word that comes to mind is train, but I think the T is going to be in the middle. It's going to be embraced by utter defeat. Ah, yes, yeah, so an utter defeat is a rout. And if that is written backwards in a T put inside it, you get shooter. So we are taking shape with one down. Wonderfully attractive person, tamed boar, ravaged. So I think an anagram of tamed boar. And it means a wonderfully attractive person. So I think it's going to be a little more than just a uh, an attractive person. I think it might be a specific one, maybe from Greek myth. Um, but uh, I'm going to have to pause, I think, and take a look at that and see if I can come up with the anagram. I'm over two so far. Uh, no, it wasn't a uh, mythology or anything like that it's simply a dream boat so yeah i think wonderfully maybe wasn't needed uh anyway i'm happy just to have worked it out shop with constant promises to provide choice Shop, what, uh, of course, a shop could be as in a, well, a store, but it could also be a factory. I think it also, you know, to, in slang, to shop somebody, to tattle on them. With constant promises. Oh, I think the promises could be IOUs. And the constant... Um, in Monday's crossword, we had pi as a constant. But uh, obviously can't be two i, can't be two i's in a row. To provide a choice, a choice maybe as in um, the best. Constant promises. No, not sure about that. Let's try 11 down, see if that S is right. Capital with top lucrative scheme. Hmm. Oh, I think a lucrative scheme sounds like it could start with money. Oh, what do you, what's the phrase, a money spinner, a money, money something or other. Oh, I can't think what the uh, phrase would be. But now where is the wordplay? Capital with top. Oh, yeah, maybe a money spinner, a, sp a spinning top. And capital is simply money. So yeah, I feel pretty good about that. All right, let's uh, come back over to the right-hand side. Avoid 
American wife. A wife could be W. So I don't know if there's some five letter word for American and then W and it's going to mean avoid or a short word for avoid followed by US meaning wife. Well, spouse, but um, the US is in SPOE, so I don't get that. All right, how about lure hospital department with diamonds? Uh, oh, yeah, so hospital department is often ER or ENT. Uh, diamonds are often ice in slang, and entice is lure. Repeatedly taking time, outsmarting, crazy, dunce. Uh, well, dunce with those letters has to be ignoramus. And now repeatedly... Taking time out. Uh, so I think it's uh, the word outsmarting, and you take T away from it twice, and then with the letters that are left, you anagram them or go crazy with them, and you get your ignoramus. Now we're avoid American wife. Oh, yes, so it's uh, the missus. Oops. Uh, miss is a void. American U.S. Yeah, when I said ending in U.S., I couldn't think of anything that did. But, of course, missus. Flick through second book by Kipling. Well, S is second. The book by Kipling is Kim. And you get skim. Students oddly fat. Well, the odd letters of student are suet, which is a typo. I'm not exactly sure what kind of fat it is, but um, recipes would always call for suet. I doubt if they still do, but if you still cook with suet, please uh, let me know. Still cold after removing top. Ooh, so I think it's going to be a long word for cold, and you're going to remove its first letter and then get a word for still. So let me pause and think about that. No, it's not coming to me. So we'll have to get some other letters. Uh, special label on succulent root. The Parisian gives insect, so I think it's going to be an insect. The Parisian, I presume, will be L or Le, sorry, Le or La, which is um, more likely. Could be lay, of course, but it says insect singular, so I think it's going to be le or la. And special, what's a short word or acronym for special? I think maybe you can do um, S for special, a label on a succulent root. No. Succulent root. What would that be? A turnip? Uh, is that succulent? I don't know if it is or not. Yam? Are they succulent roots? Hmm. What would label be? A tab? Insect. I 
can only think of like a stick insect. Um, I do think it might begin ST. There's something at the back of my mind. No. All right. How about idiots returning to government cheat? So I presume it's a word for idiots going backwards. And does it mean government cheat? Or is it idiots going backwards to, well, what would government be? I'm thinking unlikely as it sounds that it, it means a government cheat. No. Uh, detain Scout roughly, which of course sounds like an anagram of those 11 letters, and leave far behind. Um, leave far behind. Ooh, um, I do, oh, I think it's out. Out. Um, out. Distance? Can that be right? I think it is. I think, do you say that in a horse race that the leader outdistanced everyone else? Huh. All right. Drone, hurt, unfortunate, male. Drone, hurt. Unfortunate sounds like an anagram. Ooh, so maybe an anagram. Oh, yes. So it's an anagram of hurt, which is T H R U in this case, and then M for male, and a thrum, a droning sound. I realize I'm going all over the place in this crossword, uh, so I've missed a lot of the clues, but at least I'm making progress. One receiving assurances, school dance is essentially cheery. I think it's going to be one receiving assurances. I'm just trying to think there's promissory notes. Oh, of course, that, that A was not uh, right. But uh, yeah, so I'm thinking prom is the school dance, then is, and then essentially cheery is the center of cheery, the two E's. So a promise E. Not a word I would have come up with on my own, but... I think the word play makes it pretty clear. All right, so LE is possible. All right, I'm going to go back up to the uh, top and just see if anything occurs to me on the former partner. No, desolate. No, I don't think that's an unusual place. Um, and that one, no, nothing on that, nothing yet on that. A group of detectives in charge becoming caustic. Uh, yes, so the first word I thought of as a synonym for caustic was acidic. And so it's A for A. The group of detectives is C-I-D. I don't remember what that stands for, but that's a detective group. And in charge is simply IC from, I think, a military abbreviation. All right. Alto singer disturbed by tenor is most annoyed. Ooh, um... I think it is going to be a superlative ending in EST. 
but alto singer disturbed by tenor alto means high so i wonder if um they're they're using that to indicate you take the top letter of singer and it's disturbed by or anagrammed with tenor is so we still need an o an i just an o and i and what else are we missing Oh, and another S. Um, snoriest isn't a word, is it? I don't think so. No, I don't think so. Most annoyed, snoriest. No, I don't think that's right. I'm not even sure about that so let's clear those all right um strive to retain british feeling okay so i think it might be a word for strive which retains b for british and it means feeling Feeling, strive, nope, heads of uh, corporate accountability, venture eventually, give way, so if you cave, you're giving in, uh, and it's the starting letters of those four words, greener, gym, conserving, power well hidden within greener uh, gym we have a hidden clue we have energy that looks like an ing word judgment which could be ruling about catholic which can be rc ruler could be r accepting old and new oh no maybe judgment then must be the um must be the definition judgment uh oh so catholic ruler could be rc and king but it accepts O and N for old and new. There's the O. Judgment. I mean, could it be something like, well, we need a C. Hmm, not sure exactly what this is. Yeah, unfortunately, some of these tricky ones overlap. So <laughs> it's possible I'm going to be left with some I can't solve at the end. All right. Uh, we looked at that one. I think we've looked at all the acrosses. Let me pause and we have at least the C and the T now and see if I can work out this anagram. That should be doable. Uh, of course, it's uh, solicitude. Not a word you hear very often. Um, ooh, so now this isn't an X. Former partner leaving exotically. Oh, so maybe X is removed Oh, so X is take. I should have realized that exotically has an X in it. So we 
remove that and then do we have yeah we have eight letters so let me work out that anagram oh boy well i'm sure you all see what i did what i mistyped but it's only when i'm trying to work out the an anagram and i'm thinking boy you can make locality from these letters which is a place but uh, it has to start with o well it only starts with o if i mistype so um could have saved myself some time there. All right, locality. Uh, so just an anagram of exotically without the X. Now let's try overturned pot plant containing artist note left exactly. Oh, so I think accurately would be exactly but that's not the uh pot plant i thought was it was going to be but there is the ra uh, so we have acute and ly oh an overturned so something has to Ah, yucca is a pot plant going backwards, and it contains the R-A, and then T-E is one of those do, re, mi, fa, so, la, t uh, notes, and so that is accurately. Ooh, so now 18 looks like delicious. Ah, so it is um, choice in the sense of the best so choice food is delicious. Again, as often happens, I'm not always 100% in agreement with the synonyms they're using in the clues. But anyway, let's see. So IOUs is the promises. Shop is the deli. Uh, and constant is C. Okay. Oh, so now 16 must be reckoning. I don't know why. I have the letters and I just had the K in the wrong place, but reckoning. So um, let's see. So that's judgment is the definition. Oh, about is re. C is Catholic. King and accepting O and N. All right. So just one left in all of the left half. Strive to retain British feeling. Ah, yes, to strive might be to vie for something. And the British makes vibe or that kind of, I was thinking of feeling as in the senses. All right, still can only think of Snorrius for that. All right, what one uh, do I have the best chance? Let, let me pause and think about this one again. No, I could only think of Fools Backwards, which is sloof. And apparently that is a Dutch word that means a drudge. Um, so that is not... Let me... um. Let me put in Snorriest here and click check this. Ah, mo oh, most annoyed must be angriest. All right, so, oh. So I can see maybe, no, Alto, oh, maybe Alto is, a plus singer plus so then singer anagrammed and then tenor i didn't did i know you could abbreviate alto to a and tenor to t maybe but i forgot if i did so that's what that is all right so i had to use the check this to uh, get that one no Still, cold, ah, yes, yeah, so I was 
looking at what it might end in, and I thought, oh, maybe something less. And uh, if you're still, you're motionless, but that is emotionless or cold in that sense of the word without its first letter. All right. Uh, still not seeing what this could be. Let's try our special. Ooh, so something uh, beetle. Oh, um, what is the a stag beetle? So special is S, label is tag. Ah, succulent root is a beet, and then L. All right, so now surely I can get the idiots returning to government sheet. I still don't get the definition, but let me pause and think about what this could have. I mean, N is the obvious one, but then idiots returning, it would have to begin GNI, which I don't think is possible. So let me just pause. Ah, well, of course it is an N. What else could it be? A sting. So yet the G is not part of the idiots returning. They are the nits, which are reversed to give stin. Government is just G, and then a sting, as in the uh, film, the sting can be a, a cheat, a, a fraud of some kind. All right, uh, that's everything in, I believe. Let me check all, confirm. Looks like all the letters are still there. All right, so I thought that was a little bit tough today. Uh, not as many of the really, really easy ones, but um, some uh, quite tricky ones. Anyway, thank you for watching and have a great day.